gamers and college football fans are having a really great week. The first college football video game in more than a decade will be released worldwide tomorrow, and it is taking college campuses by storm. WTVA's Sammy Costas is live tonight in the studio to share how MSU fans are gearing up for the big Friday release. College football fans are over the moon excited about this video game launch. Fans and athletes got the unique opportunity to welcome the game with maroon and white royalty tonight. Uh, good graphics, good celebrations. They got all the, they got all the stuff right. Winning. I'm not looking forward to losing to somebody, so I'm looking forward to winning again. The college football games were very popular in the early 2010s, but they were canceled since the players couldn't be compensated for actually being in the game. The approval of name, image, and likeness deals opened the door for the video game's return. Some fans have been waiting over half of their life for the game to come back. Dream come true for a lot of guys coming out of high school. So I know if I was a football player coming out of high school, I'd want to get to college as quick as possible just so I could be in the game. More options and more players, more variety. Like 128 teams in one video game is a lot. Maroon and white legends like Emmanuel Forbes, JT Gray, Bookie Watson, and more were a part of the launch party at the Hump. They played the game with fans. So video games are taking over the world, but it's like real exciting, you know. It's bringing people together, like former players or sort the of newer players, and just getting to inter interact with everybody. So yeah, it's, it's a good, it's a good event. You know, I grew up watching a lot of these guys. So I, when else I saw that former players would be here, I thought it'd be a great opportunity. What do you think about the Mississippi State side? Of things on the game is it accurate what's it look like oh uh, it's very accurate i wish they could make us a little better but it's it's, it's pretty good tickets cost a hundred dollars a piece to play in the 32 person tourney next to the msu greats general admission tickets were also available all of the proceeds were going to the bulldog initiative cobb thomas is a student at mississippi state he grew up playing the original games with his dad and when this one came out, I asked him, I was like, hey, you want to play the new game? He's like, yeah, sure. Um, he beat me 82 nothing. So honestly, it should be him here right now instead of me. I feel like he could win it a lot better. But yeah, I feel like this is 11 years in the making. It's about time they come back. Emmanuel Forbes told me he just wishes EA Sports would have released the game while he was in college so he could have been in it. EA Sports College Football 25 will be released worldwide tomorrow. Live in the studio, Sammy Costas, WTVA 9 News.